Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix out the low FPS stutters and the FPS drop on your PC while you're gaming. If you have a low end PC or a high end PC, so guys, in this video, I'm going to show you some tweaks, which is guys, in-depth tweaks. And you can also know these methods, but this will guys help you a lot guys if you do it with my these methods. So just guys, make sure the world is completely till the end because this is guys really important video for you. If you watch this video, so you will get surely 50 plus FPS on your any PC. So guys, just make sure to stick with this video till the end. And if this is your first time here on my channel, Vpex, so make sure to subscribe, turn on the notification and also like this video. And guys, also tell me or share your experience into the comment box of this video. So guys, let's just go straight into this video. So guys, the first thing which you need to do, just guys, open up your control panel. Because first of all, we are going to create a powerful power plan for PC. So just go here and just view it by the categories. And now you need to just go ahead for the power options. So where is our power options? So go into the system and security sections. And guys, here is our power option into the control panel. First of all, we are going to create a powerful power plan for our PC. Just I'm going to show you how to create this power plan by your own. So just click on this create a power plan and just set it onto the high performance and just name it anything. I'm just just uh, suggest you to just name it for the gaming. Press next and guys set it onto the never. It is already by default onto the never. So just leave it. Just click on this create button. So guys here over power plan is created now so now we're going to just change some advanced settings in over this power plan so first of all go for the change advanced settings and here is guys over active power plan so first of all you need to just turn off the hard disk and just set out this uh setting minute onto the zero both guys it is also increase the performance of your hard disk and the loading time or the copying file from your hard disk so just after doing out it here is the desktop settings show slide and just here is the available and the pause so just set it on the pause to increasing the performance of your windows for just for the gaming next here is the wireless adapter settings here is the power saving mode just set it on to the maximum performance here is the pci express go into this link save and here is the power management state so just set it on to the off go for the processor power management click on this plus button and expand out the processor power management here is the minimum uh, state of the processor so just set it onto the 100 percent here is the uh, system cooling policy set it onto the activate here is the maximum performance state and set it also onto the 100 percent next thing here is the display just go for the turn of the display after click ok and set it onto the never next here is the multimedia settings just go here into this and just click onto the plus button again and just guys just follow out my these multimedia settings from here just after doing out it you click onto this uh, apply button and apply out all of these settings so guys now we are going to optimize our ram and increase the speed of our ram for the gaming so just for doing it you need to just go for the this pc properties click onto this pc go for the properties and guys here is the option for the advanced system settings just go here into this one and guys next thing which you need to do go for the performance settings and just set it onto the uh, custom and from here just select out two boxes you can also set it onto the adjust by for the best performance and just from here you need to just select the show thumbnail instead of the icon show shadow under the mouse pointer and just here is the smooth edges of the font just check out these uh, three boxes apply the settings now go for the advanced settings and here it is the most important thing so just go for the advanced tab select out the program from here go for the change and uncheck guys this box from here now click on to this non paging click ok click ok yes apply the settings and click ok again just guys after doing out it it will ask you for the uh, restart but we are not going to restart it yet so just click on to the restart later just after doing out it now you need to download a boost pack i will give you the link of this boost pack into the descriptions of my this video so just go there and download the 2021 gaming optimization pack for the gaming this is guys just for the gamers if you are a gamer play games on your pc so guys this boost pack will be guys increase your performance of your pc so just open up this uh boost pack which is the gaming optimization pack and here's guys two files first is the readme file you can also read out all of these guys are also following out these methods and i just write out it here into this text file so just you can also check it out all of these but i will not recommend you to guys just read out it because i'm also showing you the same thing into this video 
So just after doing out it, now here is guys option which is the quick CPU setup. Just here is the software file, guys this is safe, no any type of virus, I'm also using it on my PC in front of you. So just right click here and extract this file here on your desktop. So guys here is the software, just double click here and install this software on your PC. Click I accept all the term and condition, click next, click next again and install this software on your PC. Guys it literally takes just one or two seconds to installing the software. So guys just click on this finish button and just also check out the box which is the launch out application so guys just after launching out this application here is the interface for the quick cpu so here is our active power plan which we have just created now here is the system uh, profile setting guy for the pc it is uh, by default onto this one but if you are onto laptop so you need to just also change out it onto the direct current because it will guys also increase your performance if you are onto the laptops here is your all the CPU cores performance. Guys, actually this is performance boost for your uh, CPU. So just after doing out it here, here is the core parking, which is the most important things. So for, because of our this power plan, guys, you can check it out here. All the settings right now onto the 100%. If you not guys create this power plan, so it is not onto the 100. So guys, before of our power plan, which we have created before, guys, all the settings are automatically done here into the software. So guys, you can check it out here, the core parking onto the 100%, the frequency scale or also onto the 100%, the turbo boost onto the 100% and the performance also onto the 100%. Guys, if some of the setting is not onto the 100%, so just drag out this guy's options and just set it onto the 100%. Just after doing out it, now click on this apply button, click OK and guys, now our setting is saved here for the CPU. Now guys, it's time to optimize our memory for our the ram so guys here is the option for the ram guys you can easily guys just uh clean up your all the rams here is the detail of my all the rams i have 16 gig of the ram on my pc which is the ddr3 and guys here you can check it out the clean memory options so guys by using this option we are going to just clean out all of our memory guys which is using in our background so just click on this clean button we just literally take some time and guys it will clean out all of the ram which is used by the background software so just guys after doing out this step now just close out it and also close the quick cpu application from your pc guys it will also running in your pc in the background so guys no problem so next we are going to just close out all of the background running application which is running right now on our pc so guys right click here go for the task manager go for the startup application and just disable out all of the unused application from here we're just disabling out it right click here click on the disable button and guys here it's disabled like guys, I have already disabled all the guys and this application which is running on my PC. Just right click here, disable these applications and guys do the same for all of your application which you not use. And guys, it is also reduce the boot time of your PC. So just after doing out all of these steps, now just close out this window. Now we are going to do some settings for our Windows gaming settings. So just go into this gaming sections. You can check it out here, the option for the graphic settings. Go for the graphic settings and select out your game here into this list. Guys, I have already added all the games which I'm playing on my PC, which is the Apex Legends, the Fortnite, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the Call of Duty Warzone. I have already added all of the game here into this list. So just after adding out all of your games here into this list, just also turn on these options. Guys, the settings are working for the both guys user, which is the AMD users or the Nvidia users. This setting is working for both. So guys, this is the actually the uh, GPU optimizations for the gaming. So just turn on this option if you have on your PC. If you don't have, so just guys leave it. Next, here is the most important thing. Just after adding out here all the guys games into this list, just click here, go for the options, set it onto the high performance. Guys, it will give you the maximum performance of your GPU for the specific game which you're running here on your PC right now. So just guys, after doing out this step, now go back into the settings. And guys, go for the gaming mode and just turn on the gaming mode here in your Windows 10. But guys, this is the important thing. If you are already updated your Windows onto the latest version, so guys, then use out this option. And if you don't have the up-to-date version of the Windows 10, so guys, don't use this option because it will guys reduce the performance of your Windows. So guys, but I will recommend you to guys just right now update your Windows and turn on the game mode on your PC for getting the best performance of your gaming on your PC. So guys, I hope so. After doing this guys, all the tweaks on your PC, you will get the insane performance increase on your low-end PCs and also on your high-end PCs and you can also get rid from the FPS drops, the low FPS problem, the stutters and guys, the other old issues. 
So guys, if you have any type of problem or the any type of guys question in your mind, so just ask me in the comment sections. And also make sure to subscribe and also turn on the notification and like this video. So guys, till the next video, Allah Hafiz and bye bye.